Hey everybody, Monty Reed here, and this is How to Lose 42 Pounds, Day 14. And now we're down to 38 pounds to go, because I made it down to 208. Many of you know when I first started doing the video, uh, the goal was to get down to 170. And I was 212, the heaviest I'd ever been. And I'll tell you what, it was frustrating. So as, as soon as I started... Like, that's the heaviest I've ever been in my life. As soon as I started trying to lose weight, I started eating more, and I went up to 215. And so now I had to lose that and get back to the 212. Now I'm down to 208. And, you know, for some people, it's easy for them to lose weight. Uh, others, it's really hard. And so I, when I was younger, it was a lot easier. But now uh, I'm just, I'm not 19 anymore. And so uh, it's been a lot of work. And as some of you know, I mentioned the splash drills and the swimming pool. And uh, I found for me, swimming is the thing because when I get in the water, all those uh, little aches and pains are a lot less because of the buoyancy, you know, floating basically of weightless. And so it takes a lot of the, uh, the weight off and also working out in the, the gym is good, uh, but there is impact from the treadmill. Less impact on the cycling, less impact on rowing. Uh, but just being in the water when I exercise, it's just me and my body pushing against the water. And it's been exercise. It has been really, really good. And swimming is just great. And I found uh, when I could get back into the pool, because with the lockdown, a lot of the pools got closed. When I could get back into the pool, the big problem now is bumping my head from doing laps. And, uh, you know... So when I did the splash drills in the lake, uh, and some of you saw the splash drills uh, video, uh, I did the splash drills in the lake, and then after I just went for a swim, and I found, you know, when it's 520 feet from one bank to the other, I don't have to worry about bumping my head. So now my laps are 520 feet each, and so I have gotten up to being able to do five laps, which uh, is a um, half mile. Uh, 520 times five. Anyway, the math, do the math. Doing a half mile. So I'm, I've gotten up to a half mile without s stopping. And then I started to feel cramp coming on. So I just, I didn't want to risk it. And so I went in and uh, I've been drinking a lot of uh, water, hydrating, uh, watching the, the uh, electrolytes and all of that. Uh, exercising as much as I can, walks. Uh, and again, the swimming has been the best thing for me. I think going down to 208, Wow, it's really made a difference. And then with this new routine, having a larger breakfast, it's been hard to adjust to, but I've been doing that. And uh, if I'm working or exercising later in the day, then I'll have a large lunch. But my goal is to have my biggest meal be breakfast so that I have all day to, to burn it off. And then making sure that I have a small uh, dinner. I actually got a cup, uh, a, not a cup, a Pyrex bowl that I use uh, for single helping to basically, I can fill that. I give myself permission to do a heaping, like <laughs> it looks like an ice cream cone. So <laughs> it's a tiny little bowl. I'll show you a picture of it in the next video, but uh, I'm allowed to, to top it or as, pot, as long as it's not falling off as high as I want to stack it, I can do that. But it's helped with portion control. And that's something my sister mentioned years ago is portion control is huge and making sure you don't go back for seconds. And I did splurge uh, last night. I uh, had a bacon blue cheeseburger at my favorite place in the world. I, I played uh, four hours uh, of golf, 18 holes of golf, with my friend Mark. And I've got a, a review video for the Glen Eagle Golf Course. I'm going to show you. I took videos of every hole. And I've got some tips for people if you've never played that course before. Yesterday was my first time. Boy, it's surprising. There's one spot where you have to hit the ball over 120 yards over blackberries just to get started. And... Um, Anyway, it's a really fun course. It's my new favorite course because it's pretty close to home. Uh, but there's three other, four other golf courses really close to my new place. And I uh, haven't played those yet. And I'll try to make sure I bring the camera with, with me and do reviews of those too. But for me, uh, golf, when I play golf, my back feels so much better. And it's just really good exercise. You're walking, you're swinging your arms. I mean, you're getting upper body and lower body exercise, cardiovascular. If you got people behind you that are in a hurry, which we did. And uh, so it was really good. And so I splurged bacon, bacon blue cheeseburger. I've been having those for, I think, f about 15 years. And uh, 12 years ago, I found the best one on the planet at a place called Webbs in Snoqualmie. If you haven't eaten there, you need to check it out. It's amazing, amazing. And um, 
But this Glen Eagle, they didn't have bacon blue cheese on the menu, but they made it for me. And it's my new favorite. It's not on the menu yet, but if you just ask for it, tell them you want the Monty Burger or the Monty Bacon Blue Cheese Burger, and they'll make it for you. It's the best, absolute best on the planet. I don't. I still haven't had a chance to talk to the chef yet. I need to find. I know that the waitress told me they do something with the beef. It's a special kind, and also the blue cheese. It's some of the best, just amazing blue cheese. Like a lot of burgers, you got to add stuff to it, but this, is, when you get it on your plate, it is ready to eat. So I splurged last night, but usually. I don't uh, eat after uh, dinner. I just have a small dinner. And then at night, if I'm, uh, I'm hungry, I got uh, just water with no calories, fizzy water, so it's flavored. But uh, basically lots and lots of fluids. And so I'm trying not to eat late at night, and it's working. I'm down to 208. So we got 38 pounds to go. This is Monty Reed for How to Lose 42 Pounds. Uh, 38 pounds to go, day 14. Thanks for checking in, guys. Talk to you soon.